Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are diving into a crucial topic for the Samsung user FRP bypass. If you have forgotten your Google account credential after a reset, don't worry, we have got you covered. FRP is a design to keep your device secure, but sometimes it can lock you out when you least accept it. In this video, I will walk you through a step-by-step -step method to bypass this feature safely and effectively. Make sure to stick around until the end for some important tips and tricks. Avoid issue down the line. Let's get started, friend. Note down, friend. In this video, I am not using any type of computer, software, laptop, etc. This video is fully based on your mobile phone. Okay, let's start the video. Please connect a Wi-Fi network or a mobile hotspot. Without Wi-Fi network, this process is not working. This is my verify page, friends. Okay, wait few seconds. This is my verify page, and there is a no option to skip. But the ending of video, you can see there is a skip option of in, in this page. So, start the tutorial without wasting any time. First, go to this emergency call and open text testing menu. Go to this receiver. Wait 5 seconds and click on this back icon and go to this black section. Wait 5 seconds. After doing, click on this press key and now go to this speaker. Okay, now click back. Okay, friend, after doing this process, go to this start option, click to agree, and wait 10 seconds on this page. Okay friend, now if you wait 10 seconds in this page, in, in your another phone, a message arrived in. Set up Galaxy M14 5G. So click on this setup button. Okay and scan this QR code unlock this device okay I unlock this device okay now Okay friends, getting account information, continue setup on your device, bit, copy data from your android device, click on this next button, click next, go to this allow button and install Samsung Smart Switch Mobile. Installing a smart switch. Wait few seconds. Wait five few seconds. Samsung a smart switch installing in my old phone. After downloading, then click on this next button. Okay, friend. Click on this continue. Click more. Click continue. Click to allow. And click allow. Click allow. Click allow. Click allow. Click allow. Go to this setting. Click permit users access. 
okay now go again and open the samsung smart switch phone click on this let's go and get connected how do you want to connect the choose wireless wireless okay wait few seconds open a smart search on your galaxy to connect wait Okay, connect over Wi-Fi, connect and connect. Okay friend, wait few seconds. If you skip the video, you cannot do this process successfully. Click on this connect. now go to the scanning scanning and go there now go to this custom option and click on this next go to this Now go to this setting and click on this transfer. Okay friend, now click more, click more and click accept. All done, click time. Okay friend, pro a new Gmail ID is add my phone. Okay, thank you. Click uh, skip anywhere and click more, click I agree, click no thanks, turn off, click I agree, now forget password or don't have a setup letter in settings, click on this skip option. Click allow, click agree, click agree. Now wait few seconds. Click next. For all setup, click on this finish icon. Click agree. Click English language. And now click continue. Click on this skip icon. Click on this skip icon. Optimize app. Recommendation. Click install and click on this finish button. Finish. After successfully removing FRP, therefore look like that. Thank you for watching.